Hey, we have here another interesting integral from MIT Integration B 2016. Problem number 17, we have the integral of e to the e to the 2016x plus 6048x dx. Okay, at first, the uh, for a second, the 6048 threw me, and then I realized that's actually just uh, 2016 times 3. So to get started, what I want to do, I don't really like an addition in the exponent, so we're going to break this up and write it as multiplication. And then another thing that bothers me is e to the e. I think this is a good indication we want a u substitution. If we have e to the u, we know how to deal with that. e to the e is pretty confusing. So I'm going to make a u substitution and call my u e to the 2016x. And then our du is going to be 2016 e to the 2016x dx. And then like I mentioned before, this being three times um, 2016, I can write u cubed like e to the 2016x cubed. Just noticing when you multiply the three and you get back to 6048. So this thing here is gonna be our u cubed. I'm just gonna rearrange and solve this for dx. So we'll divide on both sides. We'll have du over 2016. But this piece right here is just u. So we'll have du over 2016u. Okay, now we're set up for our substitution. So we'll have this part of first piece is going to be e to the u. Then this, like we said, is going to be u cubed. And our dx is going to be du over 2016u. I'm going to take this 2016, just going to pull that out front, and we're going to cancel a u here. And so let's see what we have left. And now we have this thing simplified as something I think a lot easier to deal with. What we can do here is this is perfect for integration by parts. When we integrate, if we, sorry, if we differentiate u squared, we're gonna be able to reduce that. So I'm gonna do integration by parts using the di method. Okay, setting up our di method or tabular integration table. This is a perfect scenario for not just integration by parts, but the di method is we're gonna to have to, to reduce this u squared, we're gonna to have to use integration by parts multiple times. So I think this is gonna be a little bit cleaner. So on the right side, integrating e to the u is just gonna be e to the u, e to the u, e to the u, very easy. Different, differentiating u squared, we're gonna have two u. Differentiating two u, we're gonna have two. Differentiating two, we get zero. And then this setup, our answer is gonna be the diagonals. The last row is gonna be an integral, but we have a zero here. Zero times e to the u is zero, so we're not worried about this integral here. So we can just kind of plug this in and get set up our answer. So writing our answer in terms of u, I'm going to keep a 2016 out front. But what I'm going to do, you see we have an e to the u in all these terms. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull that e to, well, basically factor it out in advance. And then I'm just going to be concerned with my uh, terms in this column. Because each, every term is going to have an e to the u. So we're going to have just u squared, don't forget the minus on here, minus 2u plus 2. Outside of the parentheses, we're gonna have e to the e to the 2016x using our u over 2016, then u squared. So u squared real quick is gonna be e to the 2016x squared. Then just bringing in our, our exponent, multiplying in the exponent, we're gonna have e to the 4032x. Then minus two u is gonna be minus two e 2016x and then just plus 2 and then I made some space for our plus C and we're done. That was MIT Integration B 2016 problem 17. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a good day.